everybody, what the fork's going on? Jackie here at Fork and Joystick, where we love grabbing and gaming. Today I'm taking a break from playing Player Unknown Battleground to bring to you some chicken fried rice. Oh yeah! Now, I know you can go to any Asian restaurant down the road and get some chicken fried rice for less than $6 during their lunch special. Always going on. Why go to another restaurant when you can make it at home for less than six bucks? It's easy, it's simple, and I'll show you how to do it. So let's go ahead and take a look at the ingredients. Hoisin sauce, oyster sauce, dark soy sauce, sriracha sauce, onion, green onions, garlic, lemon, carrots, pepper, salt, rice, eggs, peas, chicken thighs. Pretty much everything's gonna get chopped up in dice. Dice the garlic, the onions, green onions, carrots, chicken, peas, rice, crybabies, candles, Moby Dick. Ah! So now, the sauce is extremely important in the fried rice. You wanna make sure uh, you have the right balance or else it's gonna come out a little weird. So I'm using two cups of white rice. So with that, I'm gonna use a third cup of dark soy sauce a teaspoon of hoisin sauce, a teaspoon of oyster sauce, and a teaspoon of sriracha sauce. And we're gonna want to mix that into a, a nice consistent blend. It's very important when we cook the ingredients because some ingredients take more time to cook than others. We don't want really hard carrots when we're eating our fried rice. All right, so we're gonna put the butter into the wok. The wok is at a medium high heat. We're going to throw two eggs into the wok and scramble it inside the wok. We're going to pull out the eggs while they're still a little runny. We'll put the eggs aside and bring them at the end. And then we'll start cooking our onions and carrots. We'll cook these for about two minutes. And then we'll put in our chicken and the garlic and start cooking that all together. Now we're going to take the sauce that we pre-made and pour a couple spoonfuls over the chicken and the ingredients to really get a little bit more flavor in there. We're going to want to cook this for about another five minutes so that way the chicken's cooked through. Now pour in your white rice and the rest of the sauce. Now, for me, I don't actually use day-old rice. You know, restaurants use warm rice. You can too. Go ahead and put in the peas and the eggs that we cooked earlier. Stir it around together. And then we're going to finish it off with some green onions, salt, and pepper and do one last stir. Mmm, it smells so good in here. All right, let's go ahead and put it on a plate. All right, let's see how it came out. It looks good. Mmm. It tastes better than it looks. Oh my god. This is way better than $6 fried rice. Oh. Gotta make it. Try it. Post your pics. Let me know what you think. This gets a thumb up from me. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share, and subscribe. It'll definitely mean a lot. Until next time, I'll see you again on Fork and Joystick. make it at home just as delicious. With my help, I will show you to take over the world. Damn it. <laughs> Lucia's gonna help me cook. He's gonna cook the fried rice. I'm just gonna watch. He's the real chef. Oh, Lucian's so cute. Ah! Put a fork in it. It's so good. I'm not even kidding. It's pretty damn good.